Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. Today we're back at the Wagon and Horses for another sunny Sunday car show. As you can see behind, some cars are leaving, some cars are just turning up. It's a very, very busy Sunday morning. I went and got my car washed this morning and didn't expect it to be this busy. So we're parked at the back of the car park. You can just see the Camaro over there and the Chrysler's over there. I'm in the process of debadging it. I've got the center caps off. Unfortunately, the badges will have to stay on the car a bit longer. Unfortunately, the old guy I brought the car off didn't understand adhesive badges. So he's drilled the Bentley badges in. I know I hate it just as much as you guys. And yeah, I get a lot of nasty remarks about the car just because a lot of people hate Bentley. And uh, I can't say I blame them. Sticking badges on a car that isn't even the same make and model is, uh, is bad enough. It's like having a BMW put an M Sport badge on it, but only 10 times worse because you might as well put an Audi badge on a BMW. But yeah, we're here. We're going to take a look at some of the cars. As I said, we're a bit late, so we haven't caught some of the cars coming in. But yeah, let's go uh, Let's go take a look around, shall we? <laughs> so there's the Camaro. We've managed to park close enough. As I said, the center caps have come off and we've got some new ones coming in from the States. It's just the Bentley badges that have to go now. We've also got the private plate to go back on once DVLA get their act together. Is a Marcos you don't usually see right next to the CTSV, one of three in the UK. And over here we've got the General Lee, personal favourite of mine. Just look at the sheer size of that. We've also got the Buick that we've seen many times before. This car is in fact for sale. So if you are interested in buying it, drop me a message and I'll contact the owner for you and uh, he'll take it from there. But uh, a stunning looking car, especially with the roof, very low. There's the Noddy car, it was owned by the Cray twins mother. If you haven't already seen the video on that on my channel, go check it out. We've also got Smokey and the Bandit. Always a pleasure to see this one. So here's Heather's Trans Am, she's one of the owners of the group, just coming back from a trip in Wales in this car, just to show you it's the perfect daily. And yeah, first thing she did when she came back last night was clean the car ready for this morning. And uh, you can really tell.
And for those of you who are big fans of Breaking Bad, I've got something here for you. Better Call Saul, another good series on with Breaking Bad. Can't beat it really. Just can't beat a classic convertible Beamer. Your Jeep might be cool, but is it carrying a machine gun kind of cool? As we come on round, we've got a shotgun and another shotgun on the dash. A low Harley Davidson. Very creative design of the Union Jack on this one.
Just look how stunning this Mustang is. With the chrome alloys, the chrome badges, the blue with the two white stripes. And the interior is just as clean. Take care, mate.
TV and movie cars side by side. Got the General Lee and Smokey and the Bandit. How's that for a photo opportunity, eh?